What's up? This is T. I'm here with Who Mag TV. I'm here at VIP Talent Connect. There are a lot of aspiring young entertainers and also a lot of celebrities here. This place is packed. So let's go check it out. I like to welcome everybody to the Who Mag movement. The underground sound that'll make you move it. Stack front to back with new exclusives. Reviews, interviews, latest news and music. We invade airwaves and it's no surprise. It's all good in the hood. Get recognized. Behind the scenes is what you get when you check on TV, DVD, and WhoMag.net. Who? Welcome to VIP Talent Connect. I'm Bill Apter. I'll be your uh, tour guide and host uh, for today. And we're letting now you're all talent. And what we do here at VIP Talent Connect is we connect people with each other. So turn to someone sitting next to you, shake hands, and connect. Let's start it off right away. VIP was looking for people of uh, different entertainment backgrounds to come in and speak to aspiring talent. Um, so obviously I had the hosting and the acting. And I wanted to be able to give back a little bit, you know, what I've learned through the entertainment process. The best advice I can give somebody who's up and coming, a young actor, is to work. Um, you know, you might not get paid for everything. You might get paid very little for some things. But as long as you keep getting that experience and keep putting it on the resume, you'll start meeting people uh, through the audience or through people who come through your shows who can get you those higher paying gigs. And it's all about connections and how you act on set, how you act with people, because they want to be, you know, a family environment. If it's not a family environment and you're being a problem, they don't want you there. How'd you get here at VIP? Believe it or not, it came from Who Mag. You know what I'm saying? I was talking, Rob is my boy from years ago, and uh, I think he did the speech um, on, at the March 31st session, and then he said, you know, it's a, a good thing going on here at VIP Town Connect. And I talked to the guy, Mike, and I, he said that he'd be interested in having you out here. So I said, hey, if it's for the kids and everything, you know what I'm saying, but bring everybody up, no problem, I'll do it. In this industry, you can't be uh, one dimension, you know what I'm saying? You have to really just broaden your horizon and let people know all the things that you doing, all the things that you have hidden in your, tucked in your pocket, you need to expose those things because not only can you inspire kids from the music side, but once you start to venture out into the other fields, then you'll let people know that once you be aspiring um, actors or producers, then they'll let you know that anything's possible. How did I get connected with VIP? Actually, Bill Actor, he contacted me, he saw the show, um, and he brought me in. I figured this was a good networking event because this brings in, you know, all different kinds of people from the entertainment industry, which is what we do as well. The school is definitely, definitely, you know, a good thing. Um, it opens a lot of doors. I know I did an internship at Radio 1 Philadelphia where I actually met the people from Wild About Philly, and that's how I got started with this. So um, it's basically about networking, you know, definitely networking. Uh, making contacts, doing internships if you can, go to school for what you want to do, it definitely opens up doors. We've had, since we've had the business since 1989, our clients have won 39 gold and platinum records, three Grammy awards, and uh, we recently broke the 100 million record sold mark that our clients have either been the artist or the producer or the engineer. A lot of people are saying the industry's dead, da da da. You know, maybe some of the major yeah, labels exactly. are struggling because they're not evolving with the times. But I think to be an unsigned artist now, it's a wonderful time because with the internet, you can distribute your music and your videos and market and make fans from all over the world on a shoestring budget where even five years ago, you never had that opportunity. What are some things that you, know, you look for as an agent? I think a marketable image. Uh, I think a great live performance because you need to be able to get out there and perform and entertain a crowd. I've seen people that their CDs are amazing, then you go catch them live and they're boring. And it's like you're not going to get a room of 5,000 people on their feet if you're boring. Just stay focused and do what you need to do and always think positive and, and hang around positive people and do the right thing. And uh, it's an old saying that's still true today, no success without struggle. Uh, we choose to do what we want because we can, but you know we all know right from wrong. So just always stay focused and do what you need to do. Stay on a positive road. Don't let nobody tell you you can't when you can. Get educated, get trained, keep training yourself, because it's an ongoing you know, mastery, as I have said. Mastery is never ending. You never master anything. You are mastering. I've done Ray, Dukes of Hazzard, Glory Road, just been lucky, and I got a new film coming out. 
Got a couple of them com coming out. One's called uh, Let the Children Play. Uh, Rob Schwartz, Eddie Hustle, doing their thing. I got another one called um, Pure Shooter with Lynn Whitfield, uh, Clifton Powell, James O. Jones. Um, we got another one called uh, The Rise and Fall of Dante Hugo. That's a trilogy. Look out for that one. That was crazy. And um, um, my film production company, Manifesto Films. What can you say were some of you know your difficulties coming up? Just staying focused, um, keeping at it, staying persistent. Um, sometimes uh, getting an age and a representation was a little difficult. And just um, weathering the whole process of uh, getting paid work. Never give up. Um, and do what you can do while you can do it. Like, you know, while it's available to you. Be where you are right now. If you're an actor, write your own scenes, write your own scripts. You know, get a, get you know, surround yourself with people who do certain certain things, and um, you know, build your craft, train, work on it.